Hey everybody. So 3D printing technology and hemp. Um, I was just listening to the Jim Brewer podcast on YouTube, which I really like and appreciate. And he lives in Southwest Florida. And so he's around a lot of the damage done by the recent outbreaks of severe storms. He has an event called Boots on the Ground, which is a charity for people who have lost things. Uh, according to him, the main necessity isn't food as much as it is things like RVs, beds, pillows, blankets, and you know things like that. <clears throat> Now hemp is a superfood, um, but it also makes just about everything. And with the help of 3D printing technology, we could easily start producing eco-friendly, biodegradable, antimicrobial, antifungal, antibacterial items like beds, pillows, RVs, shelters, homes, doors, and the list goes on. So it does take four months for the hemp to be able to be harvested. And so we could start planting seeds now and we could use whatever type of surplus we do have to fuel the needs of 3D printing technology. The surplus, like whatever type of hemp already exists, we could try and work with those people to use their hemp and, you know, infiltrate, infiltrate, implement it into our 3D printing technology and start printing out the things that the people really need. Um, and so we can grow our own hemp. A small or large 3D printing factory might not be a bad idea, and one where we are non-profit driven, but rather uh, driven by the need and spiritually guided towards God and away from love of money and material things. Ideally, a good government would already have a system like this up and running, but because we don't exactly have that right now, it is up to us, the people, to take care of ourselves and each other. Now, we will have different things to offer. Some do have money and some do have youth and wealth, and the two together with the Bible guiding us feels like a good team which has the possibility to really bring about some real good and sustainable results. Um, <clears throat> sorry, it's kind of a sloppy writing, but uh, it is what it is, man. All right, y'all take care. Bye.